gone. We're not going to eat that one, that one went flying, didn't it? But there we go, End, endless fun. Hello. Hi. Hello. Today we've got Pop Chef. Nothing to do with Bieber and One Direction, thank God. So you've got Push, Pop and Eat. Looks like you make lovely shapes out of various fruits. Mm. So we're going to give it a go and see if it's any good. What do you reckon, Katty? Should we give it a go? Yeah. Unpack it. See how easily it comes out of the packaging. Got bamboo sticks. Careful now, they've got sharp points at one end, can't you? We've got an interesting piece of white plastic in there as well. So, what we've got here. That's obviously to help push it out. And we've got, let's see. The best results instructions for it. So if food gets stuck inside the cutter, remove cutter from the stem and gently poke the blunt end of a skewer through the air hole. Nice. Uh, it's a precision cutting tool. To avoid damaging the cutter's edge, please follow the instructions above and in enclosed manual. There we go. Detach cutters for storing. Okay, let's have a look at the little manual here. Yeah. A recipe is almost like. Right? Pop chef, how to disassemble. It's a dislodging tool, that's what that is. There we go. Seaside oh Pop Chef cookies, ham and cheese sandwiches, mm. buttercream fondant Pop Chef cupcake and cupcake decorations. I'm getting hungry now. So, shall we give it a go? We got some. Uh, I want butterfly, butterfly. Got, oh, butterfly, butterfly. There we go. Just a plain vanilla circle. So what we got else here? Hearts, very nice. I don't know if you can see that or not. Butterfly. Butterfly, and we got star. And have you got it in here? As you, as my assistant has ably demonstrated here, it goes together very easily. So it just fits in like that. See, even a daddy can do it. So let's give it a go. And there you go, sweetheart. Try out the watermelon because that's not so big. Okay. I do it. You do it. Push that a bit more. Bit more. There we go. Yep. Let's give it a bit of a tight squeeze down. And now do you want to try and pull it out? See if it comes out, all right? There you go. And then just point it at the plate and squeeze it, sweetheart. See if it comes out easily enough. No, no, no. Wait. Just there. A butterfly. It's not a bad butterfly, it's more like a butterfly than a you know. <laughs> And then, then daddy drops it everywhere. Um, <laughs> you want another shape or another butterfly? Um, another shape. Right, okay, we're going to go for the star. Let's try the star. Do you want to fit it on? You did very well last time, we're putting it on. Let's see if you can do it again. There we go, and twist. Oh, a bit more. No, it's not quite on. There we go, that's better. You do it. Another one. Okay, hey. And then give it a really good squeeze. It has to be above the plate, so otherwise it won't go. See. I think we've hit a bit of a snag with this. It's not so much popping as oozing. There you go, that was a pop in the end. Uh, do you want to try another bit of fruit? Put a kiwi fruit, see how it works with a kiwi fruit. What the Okay. There you go, darling. <laughs> Straight to the wall now. There we go. Good girl. And press down. Try and keep it straight. And down. And out. There we go. And again, pop. Oh, that one. That one came out nicely, didn't it? <laughs> yeah. So, should we make up a little healthy 
kebab out of these fruit then? Yeah. Uh, we'll go on there like that. Very big. And do it like that. There we go. And we could even put that on top like that. It's almost like a little Christmas tree. Yeah. So do you want to try another shape? Yeah. Shall we try it with this melon? I don't think it's going to work with this melon. Do you? What would work with that? Because it's melon. Oh, the circles would just about work. Star. I want... I want to. I don't think it's going to work. Katya, it's not going to work with that one. That might work. So some of these are a lot larger than others. See, that can go... It. Yeah, just showing the... Well, that's... Some of these are quite big then. We have to use the sensor to dislodge it, but I think we can prize it out using the hole. There we go, look. Yeah. There we go. So, melon, you have to be a bit careful about what you're using. Oh, yeah. We need this one. That, I don't even know where that one will pop one. out, will it? Wait. <laughs> that was like a spud gun, that one. That was excellent, that one. I'm going to do that again. Bring out the inner child. There we go. And see if we can get that one. It's a gun. <laughs> <laughs> We're not going to eat that one. That one went flying, didn't it? But there we go. End, endless fun. So I don't think this one will do that though. Oh, it just came out. So there you go. I wonder if it does it. I'm going to do it. Try it with the watermelon now. Yeah. Any luck? It's a short range weapon, but you know, useful. Right, now, I think we could do something quite funky here. So, we take this that, and we use the flower. Yeah. Can you do the flower out of that for me, please, sweetheart? Do it and do it. Let's push down on it. No. Right. <laughs> Yeah, that's good. Now, turn it around. See if you can just bang it. See if that makes any difference. It makes it easy for you. And again. There you go. That's the way to do it. Let's uh, punch it. That's the way to do it. Now, we need this one here. Uh, oops, I've taken the wrong bits out. There you go. It comes apart very easily by the looks of it. Well, presumably for washing. So, I'll put that back in there. And uh, put that there like that. Now, I'm going to cut the middle bit out. Yeah. Give it a pop again. You want to bang on it? Hey! <laughs> pop a pop sound that time. That's definitely Pop Chef. And I think that would be quite a good game show. Something along the lines of Checkers plays Pop, but with food. What do you reckon? Alright, there we go. If you see it, Vendor Mole come up with it, it was my idea first. Okay, and. Another pop. Hey! Yeah. You can put that inside there like that, see? Ooh, what do you reckon of that? Yeah. It's good, isn't it? There you go. That's cool. Cool fruit. I was going to say cool beans, but they're not beans, it's fruit. There you go. What's it taste like? It's yeah. almost like a fruit cocktail now on a stick. Brilliant. I like that. That's good. I want that one to this one. You want some more? Yeah. I want star, star. 
You won't be able to do that with star. You're going to do it with, well, I did it with flower, didn't we? Wouldn't you do it with, with star? No, but you might be able to do air. Ah, there we go. Let's try it with that, shall we? So, we do that. Mm. Oh, here we go, sorry. If I just do this. Because this bit, oh, water. depending on the fruit, needs a bit of pressure from it. There we go, it didn't come out quite so Fruit destruction. Right, and pop. There we go. Now, I think. Uh, that would work. See if I can find any sort of enough for a star on this. Ah, I know what I'm gonna do. There we go. Not that one. That one will be big enough though. kiwi fruit in the middle. So Katia, do you like this? Yeah. Yeah? It's good fun, isn't it? Yeah. How for you, a fun way of eating fruit. And we're going to try it sometime with biscuits. Yeah? Yes. I think it's going to make nice, nice biscuits with these. It'll be very nice. Because some of these are a bit large for the small fruit. And as I say, hey. lovely honeydew, man, and it's not going to work. But overall, thumbs up, Katia? Yeah. Thumbs up. Goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye.